first time entrepreneurs focus on the product, the quality of the product. Second time entrepreneurs focus on the distribution of the product. It's gotta be your importance somewhere in the world. January 12, 2024, 160 days since cigarette, 18 since drinking, 12 smoking weed, 12 vaping, 11 out of 12 physical activity, 10 out of 12 flossing, 11 out of 12 meditating, 4 out of 12 core, 1 out of 12 cold chuck therapy, 2 out of 12 no fat, 3 out of 12, sorry, 9 out of 12 reading. 5 out of 10 physical health, 6 out of 10 mental health, five, 4 out of 10 career productivity, 6 out of 10 friendship relationships, 6 out of 10 general happiness, 8,019 out of 14,600. Up at 7 a.m., breakfast 7.05, at work for 7.50, avoiding work all day, and then I was chatting with somebody about traveling from 10.30 to 12.30, then I was done work, then I had lunch with two of my buddies, we were talking for a good hour I was playing squash from about um, 2.15 to 3.30 then I was at the volunteering Salvation Army for about 5 o'clock two of the other volunteers were already there so I left in 20 minutes 7.20 or 5.20 or so I grabbed some coffee, grabbed a hot chocolate I was back here for about 5.45 had some supper up here and watched Instagram Reels alone and then I was frustrated figuring trying to figure out um, Microsoft Teams for business the podcast hopefully I was doing that until 8 o'clock so about an hour then I was really pissed trying to figure out flights and then a credit card problem <sighs> so annoying everything's correct except for some reason the CVV the code on the back of my card is doesn't work. And I did one week of my emergency responses course, my EMT certification course. That's what I did. Um, then I was just pissed, so then I started watching random videos on YouTube because it was a shitty night. I was pissed, lonely, and boring Friday night. And I was in bed for midnight. Two roses. I'm still happy that I'm alive and well. Happy to have a family. One thorn I'm bothered by how useless I feel. One but I'm looking forward to seeing the next country. One memory. Um, playing paper and tape ball during third period at the back of the library with a bunch of friends. Set up a bunch of desks as like a fly ball court thing. And we're just playing paper tape ball, keep up with our hands or our feet, whatever we wanted to. Fitness, two hours, career, seven hours, living, one hour, growth, one hour, rest, recovery, six, and sleeping, seven. Yes, I'm sick as shit. I got a cold, I think. It's like minus 16 today. Got an Arctic swell. I feel useless and hopeless today. Um, I'll speak as somebody about traveling, and I'm at one of the most fertile points of my life and I don't feel like I'm doing anything to embrace it and then I'm worried about screen time excessive time I spend on my phone and social media maybe it's making me dumber maybe it's making me less ambitious fap There's a concept that I heard about on a podcast that said you should design times to worry about different things. Tonight was one of those nights. I was worrying about pretty well freaking everything. Look at this. That's what I keep picking at. My nail's like coming out from the bottom, so I'm like picking it from the bottom. But there's like some alive nail and some not alive now. I'm very fidgety and antsy. And I'm like, <laughs> I, don't know. I don't know why I'm so stressed out about this stuff. 
I should be able to just go out and enjoy a Friday night. But I know that I'd be sitting in the corner watching people dance, drunk on the floor all night. And it's embarrassing, frankly. I just can't do it. I can't go to a club, can't go to a bar. They're just not designed for it, I swear. Maybe it's the group of friends. Maybe it's because I don't, I'm not friends with people that like going out to bars, that they are similar to me in that way. Maybe I just don't care. Maybe I'm okay being alone for a while. But it's nice like this that it gets friggin' lonely. I know I'm not the only one going through this shit. No, I'm not crying. My nose is just friggin' stuffy. Um, I know I'm not the only one going through this sort of shit. But, you know, it sucks. It sucks. If ever you get to a point, I'm speaking of future me, if ever you look back on these journal logs and you have so much more success than what I have right now, I'm really proud of you that you managed to figure it out because I fucking couldn't. I hope this is just a stage. I hope it's temporary. I hope you get kids. Find a wife. Hope all your nails are intact. I hope you're useful. You're freaking useful somewhere in the world. Because I don't feel like it. I spent time in the industry. You're just a freaking bookworm <laughs> right now. Just keep your nose in the books, man. Keep the theory based education up to standard. Fucking helps you in first world. But. I just feel shitty and fucking miserable and sad for myself tonight. Didn't even think about going out tonight. Don't know who I'm going to go out with. Don't want to. Think about downloading Tinder. Like, for what end? Trying to get fucking coursework done. Couldn't do that. <laughs> Med tech training, can't get that started. Car claim, can't get that pushed. Ride along program, can't get that done. It's all out of my hands. Couldn't even fucking get a flight book today. Tried to. Credit card couldn't fucking work. Fucking bullshit. Just one after another tonight. Fucking threw me in a shitty fucking mood. This fucking YouTube channel isn't even worth it. It's just journal logs. It's really just journal logs. But the quality of the content, I believe, is there. It's just not for me to find. Change your lens, figure out how to distribute. You know what your product is. You just distribute it. I gotta get to bed till 11.30. Apparently I'm still fucking getting up tomorrow morning. <laughs> Even though I shouldn't. Or get to sleep at a little bit till 8 a.m. Anyways. Thanks for watching if you are. If you're in, then you're missing out as always. Toodles.